Petroleum jelly. Petroleum jelly. A byproduct of petrol. So it burns really well. And what we call it is a fire extender. In your survival tin you will have candles. And you go and get your little survival tin, put them in your web in your web and you will have a candle. So here's what else I'm gonna do. I'm gonna put candle wax on this, but as you can see I'm not using a whole candle. Because this might have to last me a long, long time. I'm just getting a few shavings. As you can see there, that hasn't got nothing on it. What I'm going to use to light these is a fire starter. So today you will be using fire starters. All that is is a ferro, uh, ferro rod and a striker. When you're using your fire starters, when you're using your fire starters, you'll see them later. You have them flat. You, you, you'll feel a, a lift on your fire starter. You'll have it flat. You lift it up one millimetre and you strike. That's it. You don't have it up. You don't have it like that, you don't have it backwards, you have it flat, lift it up one millimetre, put a bit of pressure on it, and strike. So what I'm going to do first, I like the one with cotton, uh, with Vaseline on. That's burning. I like the one with candle wax. Give it a few seconds. Then I like the one with nothing on it. Look at that, what a first time, eh? Fucking bothers me, aren't they, boys? <laughs> <laughs> now, if you're in a survival situation, we should now. Just looking at these, start having a little thing. What's going to give me the best possible chance to get a fire going? Candle wax and Vaseline. It's going to burn a lot longer, it's a fire extender. You'll see in a minute, the candle wax will burn out, but the Vaseline will burn a lot longer. But that doesn't mean I cannot still get a fire with nothing. But people always say to me, if you're in a survival situation, what else can you use to extend your fire? What can you use? In the wilderness. Right. No, a fire, a, some sort of liquid to keep it burning. What's that? Sap. Sap. So pine resin. That's what we're going to go through in these pine trees. Here. You can see all the pine trees. Sap the tree, get all the resin out of it. And it's going to give me the same effect as them two there still burning. Now, like I said, you can still get a fire going with nothing on it. Nothing on your tin there. You've got to be prepared. You've got to have your, your kindling ready, your fuel ready to all put on. But if I had a fire extender, it's going to give me more of a chance to get a fire going in it. So that's why we do that, that's our fire extender. 